Welcome to me and you outside. I'm sure glad you're here. Hey, I tell you what, um, my son and I went deer hunting this last Saturday. This is now on a this is now on a Tuesday. We went last Saturday deer hunting, and he shot a nice buck. Now I shot at a deer at a, at a young deer, and I just flat missed it with my crossbow. And how I missed it, I just got done shooting my crossbow and got it all sided back in. So I'm good to go now. But um, anyways, I had my I had my GoPro camera on my hat. I had one also mounted to the crossbow. So I turned the one on the crossbow. I turned it off after I missed that deer. But I failed to turn the camera off. It was on my head. And then my son, uh, um, I had already discovered that he had shot a nice buck. And he was going to come to me in the deer stand. And then we're going to get the truck. And we're going to drive around and try to drive up to that deer. The whole time this was going on, my camera on my head was running. And I did not realize it. Now you can look at a camera, right? like you look at this camera I'm talking to you right now, and it's got a front screen on it, so I can tell that the, that the camera's on. But I can also turn that front screen off, which I did that morning because I didn't want it to be something that might uh, show up and spook deer just a little bit. So I had turned off the um, the front screen on uh, both cameras, actually. And so the camera on my head is it's it's running the whole time, and my son comes walking up. You'll see all this on video. He comes walking, and he doesn't realize the camera's on either because the front screen's not on, and there's no red light blinking, nothing like that. And um, he didn't know it was on either. So the, the, the thing ran from the time I climbed down the deer stand, we drove around to this buck that he shot, this nice buck, and it's all done without even knowing that we are videoing ourselves. And because I wasn't going to video that part of it. I wasn't going to video. We didn't get a kill on video, so I just wasn't going to run the camera. We we're going to do what we always do is go get the deer, bring it home, process it, and all that stuff. So what you're watching, what you're going to watch here is a, a video of us just being who we are in the woods after we shoot it. Here's what we do. And it's, it's how we talk, is what we say, and stuff like that. And, and have no idea that I was videoing until I got home. Got thinking, why is this camera got such a, a two or three gigabytes of, of video in here? What is going on? So I started watching. Oh, my goodness, left that camera running the whole time. It's kind of funny, actually, for us because I didn't mean to video. But anyways, I did. Got this on video. So what you're going to watch is that right there. It's kind of fun. It's just something kind of cool. Um, knowing that you're doing something, you did something. And the whole video is about an hour long, but I cut it down about 12 minutes because I didn't want to you know, bore you with all the stuff. But So I, I went ahead and edited it. Edited. But uh, here it goes, the video. Not knowing the camera's running the whole time. I promise you, we had no idea. Wasn't planning on video on that part of the hunt or any part of this hunt uh, uh, in that way. Wanted to get a kill on video, and uh, you saw me miss that deer. That would have been the video I was after, uh, but it didn't work out. So here it is. This is that video right here. it i saw two yeah well i saw that one chasing that doe up there it looked like a forked horn near a spike i thought it was a doe he come walking right through here that spike did probably it's a small one his spikes were about that tall i don't know can you try it oh hurt you It's high enough, it is showing. I didn't drink no coffee, didn't eat my sandwich or nothing. I didn't eat my sandwich. I drank a little bit of coffee, but it, was, it just felt right this morning. Oh, felt like didn't it though? There's gonna be deer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Looked good from up there, did it? I love setting in uh, timber like that. Oh, you see for such a long way. Yeah, I love it. You shoot about 80 yards. Easy. Uh, uh, 
turn towards that other path. Is he an eight? I think he's an eight, yeah. He's, a, he's at least an eight. You didn't walk up to him? No, I walked up to him. He, he uh, shot him and he ran right towards that other property. I thought, yeah. oh crap. And then he died right before <gasps> the fence. Did he see the, what, he ran up and just stopped? No, he just tumbled. He Damn. did. You should see the blood right where I shot him. It's just a spray pattern of blood all the way. Yeah, you hard shot him. Yeah. I found, I saw the arrow. I didn't go get it, but I saw the arrow. Oh, good. But, uh, Told you he didn't cross that fence. He is an eight, a good one. He died right before he got over that fence. Oh, look at that. Oh. My what the heck. Drive up here like that. We'll get some good pictures here. Nice body. Holy cow. Big old body. Oh, look at that. Sean, that's a good deer. Look where I hit him. So I hit him. Oh. It was almost straight down. So it came right down into it. Did you send that picture to Zachary? I, yeah, that from the stand, yeah. That looks really good. That's a nice buck. Oh, heck yeah. He is a good buck. It'll get me wrong. <laughs> He's bigger than I thought, actually. He's Look beautiful. Out. Look at the body on that oh, thing. Yeah. When I saw him out in that field at first, I was like, Zach, that Wow. He's a huge body. Let's go to the stand. Where's it at? I want to. I want to see what. I want. Yeah, that's what I want so to here's see. Here's the blood trail. Okay. Yeah. This is where he like started to tumble and fall. Oh, you can tell right here. Yeah, right right here. He's dead before he hit the ground. That's a good bunch, Sean. <laughs> you got some good jerky there. Oh yeah. That was good. Oh, look at the squirting blood. Huh? I wish you hadn't seen him fall so we could have had to track him. <laughs> know, That's pretty I cool. I was like, oh my gosh, you just fell. <laughs> There's your stand. I'm so sick of putting stands up for you. I'm about done doing that. Okay, is that where he was standing? No, he's standing down here. Oh, the arrow just kind of went through. Whoa. He was standing right here, and I was right up there. Oh. In that tree. Oh. And look at the immediate blood. Look at this blood that happened like within oh. a millisecond. He just oh. started squirting blood. <laughs> oh, my. I can see him in that field. Okay. Up there, you can see that yeah, field. yeah. He's walking across this way. Yeah. And then later, so that doe came right up through here. Yeah. But then he came up. I thought he was going to fall right behind uh -huh. me, but he came over here for some Now, way. when you saw him, like, up in the timber, you're like, I'm going to shoot that deer. Oh, yeah. I was like, oh, I knew it was him. And I was like, yeah, I'm yeah. going to shoot that deer. <laughs> and he came walking over this way, and he kind of was going, like, I can go over that way. Uh-huh. And then he got, like, right over here, and then he turned and just came right oh, up over here. I'm God. standing right there. And he was standing yeah. right here. Yeah. That's where he was. <sighs> now, when you, when you went, boom, did you see the arrow go in him? I heard it. I heard it, but I couldn't see. See this? See yeah, this that limb there. Stuff? Is that the one you had to yeah, duck? It was right below yeah. that, because I was just uh, my head was just yeah. above that stuff. So well, if like, we have to, we'll just saw that little tree down. Little limbs right there. But he wouldn't care at all. He just happened to stand right here. You know, if he would have taken, I was expecting him to go like one or two uh -huh. steps. Uh -huh. he'd be like right here, uh -huh. would have been. Uh huh. Yeah. But uh, it worked out. <laughs> How was that? How was that climbing stand? How was it? Bad. Bad. Was it comfortable once you got up there? Yeah, I didn't really sit down though. Oh After really? I, could tell, I was like, this morning feels like I need to. Sit yeah, down. yeah. So I stood up and just stayed. Most stood of the time, you stood up. Yeah. yeah. You push him out toward me. Oh gosh. <clears throat> Let's get one kind of to the side. Turn him just a little bit. There you go. Oh, that's a good one. Okay, that's wonderful, man. Dang, look at the size of that. That's one buck. of the bigger body deer I ever killed. He is a big buck. Yeah, get one of them sent to you. I, I took several, like six or so. You like all of them, though. Working out. There's a 
double long shot sure. I got a butt out if you want to mess with that. Let's cut it out real fast. God, it's still hot. That is one big heart now. I do agree with these being in your video. What? Ten things every deer hunter should have. Oh yeah. This is like an absolute. <laughs> yeah. Isn't he, Sean? Or is it just me? Is it just me? I'd shoot him. Let's put him. Oh, look at this right there. Oh, my God. Yeah, he's big. <laughs> See how hard that'd be to pull him around. He'd sure do it. Timber like that with them leaves, it gets easy with these, you know. Let me move some of this stuff around so we can. Do it like that? Yep. One, two, three. How's that, huh? That is easier than trying oh to. Oh my gosh. That dead weight. Oh, arrow. Mm -hmm. Yes, I did. Yeah, you could use that again, especially for turkeys or something, you know? Yeah. I don't think it hit much bone. I mean, it made the perfect sound, though, when I released that arrow. The only other bad thing was happened was my, my little peep sight always twists on me, and I forgot to fix it this morning before I pulled back. So when I pulled back, I couldn't see through it. So I had to, like, okay. You know, thankfully, he was that close. If it had been a 30 or 40-yard shot, I would have had to, like, let down. Try to twist that and try to do it again, but so what'd you do? Did you did you ever get I could in the? Barely peak? see through it. It was twisted, but I could barely see through it, and it was just enough. And it was so close. Yeah, I could just kind of guesstimate where my eye needed to be and everything, and just did it. Which I probably shot him a little higher than I intended to, to be honest. But at that angle, that's okay. Yeah, that, yeah. What? I mean, Obviously. Oh yeah, everything worked out. It's all. Well, yeah. Who cares? It's just ridiculous. <laughs> I'm glad you got four covers in here. Yeah, I did. Good ones, too. Yeah. Look at this big old wide. You know what? I know. This might be a great place for a rifle stand. Yeah. Got, if, there had, if you had the right tree where you could see all the way up there and down yeah. here, up here on top of the hill, because mm -hmm. you know they cross here a lot. Oh, yeah. This is where I thought they were going to come running up through. When they were coming, I thought, oh boy, they're going to come. On the problem hunting on a, you know, with that property, you oh, shoot know. one, you, you know, jumps onto that. Property yeah, I mean, who knows here. what kind of people they are? You know yeah, what I mean? Oh yeah, especially on like opening day or something during the mm -hmm. week. You know, a little more lax with that stuff. But. <laughs> Checking in. There ain't no hurry. You got 24 hours. Right. Pretty cool. Well, there you go. There it is. That was it right there. Only a little, about a little over 12 minutes time I had the front and the back on it. But um, appreciate you watching that video right there. I hope you enjoyed it. We enjoyed uh, watching after we got it made. It's kind of funny. But um, I just appreciate you subscribing to my channel. I appreciate you hit the like button if you don't care. Make a comment about something if you want to. And uh, just appreciate y'all being out there. So no matter where you're at in this world, my friends, have a good morning, good day, good night. Because another video is coming right around the corner.